Aviva's electric chat. Hi, ready to test the new electric eel power suit? I'll release some robofish into the water, and you help Martin catch them with the eel's awesome zap power. Electric eels send out electrical charges to sense their surroundings. See the map at the bottom? Those dots show you where the other creatures are. There's the first one. The robofish has an antenna on its head. You need to swim near it to use your electric power. Use the arrow keys to move in the direction you want to swim. Fantastico! When you're close to the robofish, press the space bar to activate your electric power. It works! You got it! The more lightning bolts you see in the bubble, the more energy you get. Okay, I've released the next wave of robofish. You can see how many you need to catch in the top corner. I think we're getting the hang of this electric eel power suit. That's good, Martin, because things are about to get a bit tougher. Your electro sense suit uses energy constantly, so you need to keep getting Robofish batteries to stay charged. If you run out of energy, our test is over. Okay, there are some more Robofish in the water now, but also some normal fish. They're the ones without the antennas. Don't zap them, or you'll lose more energy. More Robofish coming up! But watch out! Now there's a caiman in the water, the electric eel's natural predator. He'll drain your energy if he bites you, so try to chase him off with your zap power first. Careful! Ready for the next wave. Okay, now Chris wants in on the fun. He's got on his caiman power suit and is going to try to catch you too. Just treat him like a normal caiman and zap him or keep away. Gotta watch out for normal. This power suit works great. Electric eels have special organs in their bodies that give off electrical charges. Come on, bro! Easy with the teeth! Watch out! Your energy is getting low! Electric eels can release different levels of energy from high to low. I've set the power suit to a low stun. Just enough to zap these robofish and scare off caimans without hurting them. Uh-oh! Watch out! Your energy is getting low! Watch out! Your energy is getting low! You need to get a... Electric eels can't see very well, so they constantly give off a low... You need to get a Robofish's battery soon, or you'll run out of energy! Hi! Ready to test the new electric eel power suit? I'll release some robofish into the water and you help Martin catch them with the eel's awesome zap power. Electric eels send out electrical charges to sense their surroundings. See the map at the bottom? Those dots show you where the other creatures are. There's the first one. It works! Just like the real electric eel. But it, you, you got it! The more lightning bolts you see in the bubble, the more energy you get. Okay. I've released the next wave of Robofish. You can see how many you need to catch in the top corner. I think we're getting the hang of this electric eel power suit. That's good, Martin, because things are about to get a bit tougher. Your electro sense view uses energy constantly, so you need to keep getting Robofish batteries to stay charged. If you run out of energy, our test is over. Okay, there are some more robofish in the water now, but also some normal fish. They're the ones without the antennas. Don't zap them, or you'll lose more energy. More robofish coming up! 
But watch out! Now there's a caiman in the water. The electric eel's natural predator. He'll drain your energy if he bites you, so try to chase him off with your zap power first. Watch out, your energy is getting low. Ready for the next wave. Okay, now Chris wants in on the fun. He's got on his Cayman power suit and is going to try to catch you too. Just treat him like a normal Cayman and zap him or keep away. Watch out, your energy is getting low. Watch out, your energy is getting low. Watch out, your energy is getting low. <laughs> Electric eels can release different levels of energy from high to low. I've set the power suit to a low stun, just enough to zap these robofish and scare off caimans without hurting them. Electric eels can't see very well so they constantly give off a low charge, which they use like radar to catch prey. See if you can find these new robofish on your map. <laughs> nice try, bro. Now that's a great creature defense. How about some more robofish? Oh, okay, okay. You got me, bro. Watch out, your energy is getting... You need to get a Robofish's battery soon, or you'll run out of energy. Sorry about that, buddy. Release the Robofish! Gotta watch out for normal fish. Don't want to zap them. We lose energy when you zap real fish. So watch out. We lose energy when you zap real fish. So watch out. How about some more robo fish? That's a great creep. I am really getting a charge out of this new power suit. We zapped a real fish by mistake. Careful! We zapped a real fish pal there. didn't want to mess with an electric eel. 
Sorry about that, buddy. Watch out, your energy is getting low. Time for some more Robo Fish. Watch out, your energy is getting low. Ah, that doesn't tickle. Watch out, your energy! Let's keep going! <laughs> Watch out, your energy! Watch out, your energy is getting low! You need to get a Robofish's battery soon, or you'll run out of energy! Watch out, your energy is getting low. You need time for some more Robo Fit. Hi, ready to test the new electric eel power suit? I'll release some Robo Fish into the water and you help Martin catch them with the eel's awesome zap power. Electric eels send out electrical charge. It works! You got it! The more lightning bolts you see in the bubble, the more energy you get. Okay, I've released the next wave of Robo Fish. You can see how many you need to catch in the top corner. I think we're getting the hang of this electric eel power suit. That's good, Martin, because things are about to get a bit tougher. Your electro sense view uses energy constantly, so you need to keep getting Robo Fish batteries to stay charged. If you run out of energy, our test is over. Okay, there are some more robofish in the water now, but also some normal fish. They're the ones without the antennas. More robofish coming up! But watch out! Now there's a caiman in the water, the electric eel's natural predator. Ready for the next wave! Okay, now Chris wants in on the fun. He's got on his caiman power suit and is going to try to catch you too. Just treat him like a normal caiman and zap him or keep away. Careful! We zapped a real fish pal there. Sorry about that. Sorry. Watch out, your energy. This power suit works great. Electric eels have special organs in their bodies that give off electrical charges. 